Got my tricycle out of storage this morning. Gotta clean it up a little bit. <laughs> Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Let me show you a couple of things about my tricycle. This is uh, made or imported by BPM Imports in uh, California. It's about $3,000. And I've made some modifications. First of all, the seat. It came with a bicycle seat. And uh, I found this old uh, go-kart seat and had it recovered. And I love it because when I sit down, it gives me back support. Oh, you heard my horn beep. That's another thing I was going to tell you about. The back support, it's good. If I'm riding a long ways, I really like that. Uh, the bicycle seat hurt my butt. Uh, the horn you heard beep. It's a Harbor Freight uh, air horn. Compressor's down there. And that thing there is a drill battery, 12-volt drill battery that runs it. And I got a button here. It gets people out of my way. Of course, uh, it came with a horn. Here's a horn, kind of wimpy, and a ding, ding, ding tricycle bell. <laughs> hey, it didn't uh, have locking bricks, and um, it's kind of hard to do one-handed, but over here I have my invention. These are, uh, we call them scrunchies. They're girls' uh, hair bands. There, my brakes are locked. And I have one for the other handlebar. It's got front and rear disc brakes. Uh, I built this box back here. It came with a canvas box. Uh, and after uh, a year or so, dust in the zipper made it hard to unzip. So I made this wooden box. And I like it better. I keep a bicycle tire pump and a chain lock and that silver bag there is a cover for when I put this on the back of the motorhome. One of the reasons I built this is because it's also a seat. If I uh, go to a campfire or if I want to give somebody a ride back to their RV, it's another chair. They make a model of this that's a rickshaw. so. There's a seat up here built for two people. So the suspension and the axles and everything here are sufficiently strong. Not a problem for somebody to sit there. I also figured out that I have reverse. I just got this out of storage and it's all... Uh, got storage dust on it. I need to clean it up, but um, I'm liking it a lot. There's something else that uh, I'm going to add to it. I have lights for the wheels, and uh, I'll be getting those on, and we'll take a ride in the dark. It'll be fun. I got the idea from uh, a friend who goes to Burning Man with a uh, bicycle that has lights on the wheels like that. It's called Taxi, if you've ever known about the Taxi Bicycle at Burning Man. Uh, there's lots of stuff to talk about about this, but I have one more thing that I'm going to add to it today. It's in my pocket here, let's talk about it. The company calls this uh, Papa Safety Alarm on the Amazon. It's they're referred to as ladies' uh, alarms. Uh, they sent me a couple of them, and uh, they're Apple-approved AirTag devices. Uh, my phone app can tell me where this tricycle is when I put this in here, anywhere I am in the world. It'll tell me where my tricycle is if I ask. It comes with uh, charging cord, a couple of gold clips, one for your belt, one for your key ring. 
lots of uh, literature directions on how to do it. I found it to be very easy. Besides being uh, an air tag for locating things with the Find Me app uh, from Apple on your Apple devices, it also is a 130 decibel alarm. That's why they call it a lady's alarm. Uh, ladies can hook it on their purse or their belt loop. And what I found it funny, one of the directions was pull the alarm and throw it as far as you can. And maybe uh, the attacker will go and try to shut the alarm off and you run the other direction. <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure that's going to work, but it's not a bad idea to try. It also has a built-in flashlight. Maybe I should do this for you at night. And uh, red and blue flashing lights like the police car. So this will be the nighttime test of the Papa Safety. There, that's the light. Pretty good. Who we got here? Miss Lynn. And you know, I was making fun of the uh, red and white, or the red and blue police. Look at that. That's this little thing. That's uh that's pretty uh in the nighttime that's wow. That's bright. But uh I'm going to use it as a tracker. This one. The second one, I'll tell you what I'm going to do with that in a minute. It's more going to be an alarm function thing. But I'm going to take this uh, and just put it in the back of my tricycle here. And I'll show you on my, just throw it in there. Oh, got the red and blue police lights flashing. There we go. Just gonna throw it in there. My tricycle goes somewhere without me. I'll know where it went. I have a second one. You're wondering what I'm gonna do with that. The one on the tricycle is white, this one's black. There's something else that I want to keep track of, and it's right over here. <laughs> this one's yours. You clip it on your belt, or you keep it with you. Maybe you put it on your purse if you're going somewhere, cigarette case. And, oh, you're going to put it on your ear, and that's not a good idea, because if you want to pull it apart to make the alarm go, you're going to pull your earring off your ear. And those are pierced ears, right? They are, so that could yes. be That could be painful. A real plan is, uh, if I'm over there working in the guest house or the yard, or maybe down there at the barn, and she falls down, or she just needs me to find something, or any one of those other thousand honeydews I get every day, she can just pull the alarm and um, I can hear it. We tested it and I could hear it way over there by the guest house. Now, I couldn't hear it down by the barn, but Peter probably could, our son. My ears are a lot older than his but the alarm's pretty loud. So what do you think about that? Also, you know, if you run off, I can find you. There's not much chance of me running anywhere. <laughs> Thanks for helping me today, Lynn. Yeah. She made me come back because she wants to demonstrate the alarm. Go ahead, pull it. Yeah. What do you need? Huh? What do you need? Another bagel. <laughs> Papa Safety Personal Safety Alarm for Women. 130 decibel a siren. Works with the Apple Find My app. Keep track of whatever you hook it to. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think about these things. If you want to know the current price, there's an Amazon link down there in the description. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. 
please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.